Joe Ferguson. The Bears defensively will start Dan Hampton, Steve McMichael, William the Refrigerator Perry, and Richard Dent. The linebackers, Otis Wilson and Mike Singletary bound for the Pro Bowl. Wilbur Marshall on the right side. Mike Richardson, Leslie Frazier on the corners, Dewerson and Fence at the safeties. The Bears with eight Pro Bowlers for this year as selected by their peers and coaching staffs around the NFL. Second down and seven. Lions at their own 25. Good protection for Ferguson. A diving catch on the sideline by Thompson again, and he has the first down yardage. Number 39, the 11-year man from Oklahoma State. Johnny, this wide receiver doesn't even get to practice. His knees are older than yours. <laughs> and that's getting pretty old. <laughs> but he hasn't practiced during the uh, week for the last month of the season, but he always comes up from some clutch catches as he did last week against Green Bay. However, the Lions did lose against Green Bay, but it looks like uh, the Lions are going to let it all hang out. The uh, first two plays, they've come out throwing. Ferguson is 29 of 51. Pass is coming into the season, working in relief of Eric Kippel. Kippel had his knee re-injured last week against Green Bay. Doctors advised against him going today. Play action on first down. Pressure from Perry. In and out of the hands of James Jones. Ferguson knocked flat as he released the ball. And he is down and looks as though he's taken a real tough shot. Apparently Wilbur Marshall, the man to make contact. It was number 72, William Perry, the refrigerator, who got through and put the pressure on Ferguson and drove him out of the pocket. So Ferguson was on the run, and you're going to see Wilbur Marshall come here and really flatten him. Oh, boy, did he really hit him. And down is Ferguson, and the Lions are in some trouble at quarterback because uh, Eric Hippel has a sore knee, but it looks like... Uh, are they looking at his shoulder? Boy, that was a real hit. Well, it looked like he took the shot on the chest, but he also appeared to bang the back of his head when he hit the artificial turf here. A Joe knockout Ferguson. blow. Yes, a 13-year veteran. He's had a few blows in his life, but the helmet was right in there. Did you notice the helmet was right in there, and then his head did bounce off the turf, and uh, he is really sore. In fact, I think they're checking in the neck area also. And there's Eric Hippo, who... Uh, no, that's not Hippo. Yeah, that's, yeah, that's yeah, there's Hippo. Yeah. Eric Hippo uh, actually uh, passing back and forth with Hunter Mike Black, who would be the emergency quarterback. Black works the uh, scout team quarterbacking duties for the Lions. And Eric Hippo, uh, who uh, in uniform with a strained knee, uh, will no doubt be coming in here. And so an early misfortune for the Lions as he talks it over with head coach Darrell Rogers. Will we turn to the Silver Dome in a moment? <laughs> 